everyone and welcome to Sense of Fashion where you will learn how to revive, restore, redeem and renew your garments. Hit the bell when subscribing to be alerted to new videos and stick towards the end for a bonus tip. In this video, I'm going to talk to you guys about dun, 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 the handheld stitch sewing machine. So I've seen my mom use this and I was like, okay, so she has this in her house and she has a sewing machine as well. I always wanted to try it out and it was like £90.99 uh, at a time on Amazon and I was like okay let me try it out because it's in between hand sewing and also having your own sewing machine and this could be something really useful for you guys who you know don't want to want to spend so much money on buying a sewing machine or you just don't have the space all the time and in the box when I had this there is no instructions so I had to like google for instructions, that's a negative part. I had this. This, this, this is all I have. Sending me to a website. I went to that website. The website was not available. It was a Facebook page. I will also suggest having basic hand sewing skills that you can do whenever you're in a place that has no machine or you're like in a restaurant and your skirt ripped. <laughs> that at least you have like a basic um, sewing kit that you can fix the seam of the skirt or a button came on down you can, you know, do your buttons, uh, sew up your buttons. Like these are basic skills and I've created a Samsung Revive hand sewing repair PDF guide that everyone who subscribed to the newsletter is able to have. So you get this free guide that will help you for life. And it is at least a tutorial that you can find. <laughs> it's not like this that has a piece of paper and you can't actually find a video on it. Like there's at least a video that goes with it and it's a step-to-step -step guide how to sew buttons, how to repair your jeans, how to reduce your hem, how to reduce your waist, all these basic stuff that will help you in life. <laughs> so, you know, click below in the description and get this free guide for you to use. This comes with a spindle. So this is you put in this place. So you have two spindles. And it's for if you have a longer thread, so the long ones. So that's a spindle. We have three bobbins, a needle, spare needle, which is good. Needle threader to thread my needle. So Three bobbing, spare needle, and a spindle. So then make sure that this is locked so you don't do it. Lift up your needle. Just take the needle out. Put it in here. Hook the thread. And hold the thread. Very handy to have. You lift the foot, but you have to very gently because it's very heavy. Whereas with a sewing machine, whoops, you see how, please make sure it's turned off by uh, pushing the slider in, or she can definitely, definitely seriously damage yourself. So it only needs like one bobbing, and this is basically the on and off button. You turn the wheel to lift the needle, so it will go to from the bobbing to a hole here, then goes to um, the sliders here, the lines straight into a underneath here, then it goes into the needle and it's threaded from that direction. When you lift the foot up, please make sure it's off, but it's just one thread. This is a starting point and then... So it's this direction. It's the opposite of the sewing machine, I will say. So I'm normally used to sewing like but here you have to go backwards so that's something different don't pull it let the machine do it because this is this what happens when you pull to let the machine for you if you don't leave it then it will unravel so it's a chain stay so it might actually be good for like your bottom of your trousers which is good let's see it's a lot on the denim definitely leave because I just want to unravel, 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 that's all of that gone. Let me know in below comments if you're gonna buy this machine or if you decide to buy the sewing machine or if you're just gonna stick to hand sewing. 
I would like to know. Let me know. Comment below. And until next time, bye-bye.